Alright guys, we got the scuttle puddle here and we have team building, cybernetic coupling and blood money as well. And I started off with an any headliner and I got wax here so I will probably play uh, emos and spellweavers comp. Uh, team building is very good for that but I have no access to blue buff and blue buff is best in slots for any. I'm looking for item upgrades there. No item upgrades. I think I'm just sticking with this then. Um, like. Okay, just slam an item. I will forge blue buff. She will get gauntlet from super fans. And then the last one. The last one will be Nature's. But I can put Hextech on what? I can put Hextech on Wex, by the way. Yeah. Let's check that. Um, yeah. Hextech Wex would be nice. Actually, I could have slammed uh, Gauntlet for Wex as well. But I will have offensive items on any anyway. So... Why would I put even more offensive items on Wex? That was the whole point. Uh, yeah. Let's put them on Wex. And see how it goes. My any is Spellweaver though. Like I would want her to be Emo. To play for Emos with Amumu. But we'll take it. Spellweaver also has some nice good synergies. Like what can I play here? More guardians, guardian, three damage, spellweaver, executioner. Turk is one. Turk is a guardian. I can put him in in the next level. Bro, well, like uh I've been grinding this set. Played lots of games here. In this LO, like I'm almost like stuck here <laughs> I'm almost like stuck here maybe even I'm stuck there but mm, I can say that wait spell weaver is better better I can say that punks are not that good right now okay they are viable and uh, if you have a lucky high roll game with six punks you might get your first place but usually when I play punks I end up being third or fourth, pl fourth place. Like they make you win the games, they give you a stable board in the early game, but they don't give you lots of LP because they just can't win the game. Like in first or second place, it's a rare stuff. It happens, but it's a rare thing. Car uh, to Sakali, Ezreal, uh, Ilawi. Art still. They are just better than punks. They just win the game in first or second place. But I noticed that any reroll, any with spell weavers and super fan, is actually so underrated. And this comp sometimes dominates the, all the other ones that I just mentioned. Okay? That's why I'm sticking with any right now. I want to test it out as well. Like maybe play 5 or 10 games with it, with her. I'm gonna try to force it as well. Like uh, I need some... Like... What can I say? I need based info like... No bullshit. I need to make sure that the things that I... Test out is consistent. I need a consistent experiment and test. Come up with some results. Okay. Steadfast is also a very good item. That's so underrated as well. That's five country, yeah? The blob. No, three country. <laughs> I got a nice front, but... Uh, I got a nice backline carries, but my front sucks. 
I only need one more super fan to get going. Like, I already planned the team planner there. Okay. Hmm. Nothing interesting, really. Just nothing interesting. Okay. Like this. I'll be right back. Right, got some food. Wow. This guy. Isn't this guy lucky? You already got 3 star Olaf. Also, 3 star Olaf starter might be the best reroll comp in the game right now. It is so amazing as well. Like, absolutely busted. And by the way. I lost so much health here, like, this is not acceptable. Where are the other enemies? Nobody is playing that. And I just couldn't hit any more enemies, that's insane. That's insanely bad luck. Hey, what is that? Shit. Really don't need Tom of Trades, but... Let's see. Spell Weaver would be interesting here in the area. Okay. Hmm. The fuck? Um, are you a spell weaver? No. Okay, you're out. You're probably out as well, wait. Some interesting things did happen back there. Like, I almost got a trick to restart. <laughs> it's... It came out of nowhere. And two star Lulu as well. I saw a three star Lulu play as well. That's too great. Yeah. Alright. Shock treatment. Static shiv would be nice. Because we are lacking that uh, magic resistance item. Vampirism, quite interesting. Mm, shield and attack speed, that's nice as well. But I think I'm just going for... I'm just going for the shock treatment, yeah. Freak it. Um... What the fuck am I doing, guys? Uh, do I want to put it on Wex or... Yeah, yeah, Lulu. For sure, Lulu. Do I want to keep Turks? No. I should be playing Nico instead of Tarek. Like I don't get, I I don't care if it is two star or three star. <laughs> if it was three star, okay, I would <laughs> I would care about that. But oh, um.
Can I hit nine spell weavers there? Okay, I got the risky move stuff there. That's quite interesting. Um, that's it. Oh, for Amumus. Okay, let us wait, let us wait. Like, I'm rolling down here to get any 3 star, but it takes ages. Maybe I should have just leveled. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. There are 7 spell weavers in the game. And we got... Emblems plus wait, wait, wait. We got emblem plus headliner. So this is just nine spell we were game. What the fuck? This is a nine spell we were game, boys. This is a freaking nine spell we were game. Did I count it right? <laughs> I, I hope I counted it right. Fuck Mumus. Oh shit. Fuck Vex. Like, I don't give a fuck. This is just pure uh, spell weavers, yeah? From now on. It's only one any. Yeah, that's it. Perfect, we got the sentinel as well. Nice one. Okay, Lulu. Lulu is also 3 star, like... I got it for free. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight spell weaver. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Wait. I count with Wait, I didn't count it right. <laughs> Did I? Yes, I did. Okay, I will play seven uh, spell weavers like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven spell weavers, and one is headliner. Amumuniko out. Okay, these are full spell weavers. Uh, do I have place for super fans? I guess no. I have no place for super fans in the late game. So I should be looking out for itemizing any. But I can play Nico. Hmm. 
I can play a KDA unit, which is Nico. Yeah. Okay. Um. Can I hit seven here? Yes, I can. But that would be weaker. Okay. That's it. That's it. Hmm. Second Ionic. Don't mind if I do. Okay, we just level and play a uh, seventh spell weaver there, yeah? Or emo. An emo guy or another spell weaver. Or just Lulu 3 star as well. Wait, that's 4 2, so they're all leveled up to 8 as well. Hmm. Red buff, green Zeus? No, not my stuff. Um, extra damage would help. Forty gold. Wait. No, no, no. Just give us a, a radiant item. And I need a tanky one. So I'm picking this. To put them on this guy. And I'm leveling up to find myself a Ahri and Ahri, but I didn't find it. Yeah, that's bad. I need Ahri boys. Okay, Gregas in, yeah, Gregas in, 7, Spell Weaver. I leveled here because uh, if you watched my recent matches, you would understand that TFT is all fun and games till the stage 4 begins. After stage 4, it's just a shit fest. Wow. This would be amazing, but it's just a shit fest after uh, stage four. Everything gets so dumb. <laughs> like people cap out their boards like crazy. If you don't get to level eight and roll for some four costs, you just lose the game. Like there was a game that I had 10 win streak until stage 4 then I had after 10 win streak then I had a fucking 9 loss streak till I die yeah that's what I, that's what I uh, wasted all my gold there that's the reason um, do I sell Vex? no I'm not looking for any more Nikos, not any more Anis, not any more Seraphins, not any more Gragasses. Ooh, can we make Spellweaver? Wait, why can't we make Spellweaver? That means Spellweavers are actually so insane that you can't even make their emblems. Hmm. Yes, I'm just putting Morellos on. Wait, oh! How come I didn't see this? Like, Warmogs would be great, but... Morelos, yeah. We have no uh, anti-heal anyway. So this would get us that anti-heal. She also deals AoE damage, so that's good. Any without emotes. <laughs> that's weird, but... If I level up to 9, like, I can ditch super fans and put in emo and put this spell we were emblem on emo guys and make this girl scale a bit further. We are waiting now. Oh, 
All I need is one Ahri and one Sona. That's then that's it. Nine platinum prismatic nine spell viewers. Like that would be insane. Like I I haven't tried nine spell viewers at all. Like I haven't hit uh, seven spell viewers in my TFT set can test set ten games. Like like never. It never happened. This guy has radiant glows, but he's still a one star. Like, what do I need? Three star Lulu, Echo 2, and one Ahri. Do they worth rolling for? No, they don't. Because if I keep my gold here, I can level to nine and find a Sona there and find Ahri as well. Then that would give me nine spell weaver. And spell where is just better than one of her placement there. Bro, we are even killing that Olaf guy because we have a crazy CC. Oof. Man. Any is just great. Wait, what happened there? Wait, is it because we have seven spell weavers? I don't know. Sep seven spell weavers can't be the one that's making that difference. Like it's not that. It's the any and Lulu. These units are just too broken. Their CCs, their utilities are just too broken. This any is doing all this stuff without emo trait. Right? Like, imagine if she had emo. Imagine if we had like. Uh, I don't know. Multiple headliner portal. Okay. We got the... Uh, we got the uh, jeweled gauntlet that we can put on any after we replace. Um, super fans. Lulu also is great with Okay, these are for Lulu Fuck Seven to do two gold, huh? Look. Echo two star would get us the win here. Or maybe if I split my board up. Okay. That's it. That's it. We got some crazy crazy uh tanks up here. Do I really want to play Vex? No, Executioner trait will not get us anything. I would like to play uh, Amumu though. Like Amumu instead of Nico. Amumu instead of Cannon. Yeah, Amumu instead of Cannon would be nice. Wait, then I lose true damage for Echo. Mm. I don't know. I don't know if I want to get to 9 spell weaver or not I can't get to 9 spell weavers without ditching super fans but I don't want to ditch super fans as well if I level here what can I play I can put in emo for any yeah I can put Emo for any, and that's that's really just worth it, guys. Or yeah, that's just really worth it. That's obviously worth it. Roll some. Okay.
we are absolutely winning this fight. Now Annie has emo as well. Do we kill that Viego? Come on, come on. Just burst him down. Any Any just didn't hit the guy who is being killing her. <laughs> but she decided to hit somebody here. Shit. We are level 9. But we just can't hit that 9 Spellweaver. And no legendaries? What? How come there is no legendaries there? Oh shit, man. Come on. Hello. Okay. Uh, but I can't sell her. <laughs> Alright. Good, good, good. Please win this game. W just win this fight. Come on, Nico. You can survive. I really don't want to lock this. I need to win this fight. I don't want to lock this. Like, I can hit 3 star Lulu. I can hit Sona. Okay, okay. One more cast. That's it, that's it, that's it, that's it. Any wins this. One more cast, any. What? Oh, shit! No way, man! Just no way! If I sell these true damage guys... Like, no way! I should win this round. Come on. Come on, man. Like, bro, let us have some fun. Come on. Come on. Okay, one more, one more. Yeah! We got it. We got it. Okay, PV round. And that's a scuttle puddle P PV. That's a scuttle puddle PV round. Oh shit. Okay, we survived. We top four. And what the fuck is this guy with 71 health? Full harm assist with pentakill, huh? This Viego killed us as well. Are they keeping my champions like Sona or some stuff? They are not. Okay, nice gold there, nice gold there. Come on, come on, be nice to me, be nice to me. Um, so I just need to sell this and play. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Ah. We killed Z. That was the main carry. Come on, hit that as real as well. Hit that as real. Oh. Ah! That's the top three, but 
Bro, why is this game so anti-fun? Like, why do they not let me have this insane cap? Like, it never happens. I don't know what is wrong with that. Like, do I have to fucking open an Oceania, Oceania account and play normals to reach that crazy stuff? Like, why I can't hit any of them? Like, I never got a 3-star forecast in TFT set 10. Like, I'm so close to hitting a 10 KDA in the previous videos. And the game doesn't let me have that last KDA unit. I'm so close to, like, one unit away. Just one Sona. And that was 9 spell we were. And the game just didn't give me any sonas at all. Like there was no fucking son sona in the carousel. Like in the uh, stage 5 carousel. There are legendary units. There are legendary units in stage 3s and stage 4s carousels. But there is no legendary unit in stage 5 carousel. What the fuck man. Come on. Like, it was a fun, enjoyable, a great game. It was an amazing one, but I was about to reach the impossible, or uh, I was about to reach, like, Nirvana, fucking Nirvana, like, nine spell weavers, prismatic trait. In the set that doesn't give you any emblems at all, I got one emblem, headliner unit, and. I got to survive with spell weavers, which are real shit. Only dispatch any rerolls, and uh, their counterparts are amazing. This is why I survived. I survived while playing uh, seven spell weavers. Like, I had naked Gragas, which is shit, and still had super fan units, which are one cost. I got to survive. Like, I survive. I keep up my eco. I do everything right. Everything works out quite well, then there is a last one step, one last step, and, and the game doesn't uh, let me take that step a bit further. Like, what the fuck? Then just <laughs> make me go dead last in the first place. Why do you give me all this juice and nice stuff and then don't let me have the freaking orgasm? <laughs> yeah? Oh, okay, that's it. That's it, man. That, that's my rant about this game and uh, TFT set 10 in general. Okay, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like the video, comment down below, and I will see you in the next one. Bobaski, GG, take care. <laughs> oh, insane, man. Insane.